All right, I'll just show a little video here to show the uh, black boxes. So wire comes out of the VDM, power comes out of the Apex, goes to the first light, um, and then this little jumper wire here goes to the second light, as you can see. And then uh, the power cord gets jumped from one to the next. And then same thing, coming out of this light, there's another jumper cable, and it jumps to the next light. Same thing, power cord jumps from that light to this light. So I've got three of them run in series and uh, it controls all three of them perfectly. So it's kind of a little test here to see if it, how many I could daisy chain together. But you know, for $375 for three of these lights, as opposed to the Neptune Skies, if I was able to buy the new, it'd be probably closer to 15 or 1600. Uh, definitely worth messing around with it's real nice because I can turn the blues on separately and they can ramp up from zero percent all the way up to a hundred and then later on I can turn the whites on and same thing the whites will ramp up from zero percent to 100 percent the only drawback is the uh, the fans don't turn off when both channels are at zero percent so you have to run them through uh, timed outlet or the fans would just stay on all the time which probably wouldn't matter them fans are they literally last forever i've had uh chato grow lights well there's one of them there's probably been running for over three years straight and the fans on them it's just been going for three or so years without being shut off so um anyway makes quite a difference in the brightness of the of this uh torch grow out tank i should say euphilia grow out making quite a difference. So now the plan is to run another string of them across the backside because this tank is really deep from front to back. It's four feet wide. So the Neptune skies don't quite cover the whole tank. So with having a string of these on the front and back, it's gonna just make it so that the power is a little better throughout the whole tank. So there you go.